Have you ever wanted to create your own talking avatar for your YouTube videos? Maybe you don't like showing your face on camera, or you want to create a unique and memorable character for your channel. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create your own talking avatar using Credo AI for free. Hi, this channel provides tutorial-based solutions to help you get started and win on YouTube. If you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified of my latest videos. Here's how to create your own talking avatar in four easy steps. The first thing you want to do is to go to your browser and type in the word creado.ai.com. When that is done, it's going to take you to the site. Then you will have to sign up using your Google account or you can enter your email right there. After that, you want to choose the kind of video you want to create. Here we have the digital human video. We have the talking photo. We have digital human PPT creation and so on. So you're going to choose the first one, which is the digital human video. And this will take you to the canvas where you start creating your videos. If you go down here, you will see tons of characters for you to choose. You can choose the one that you want or you can equally import your own character to this canvas and make use of it so here we're going to choose this one and then this is it it shows the full image of this character now we want to turn on the green screen this will allow us to remove the background and then bring in another background using cap cut so when that is done i will need to go and get the text that i want to use for this character so i copy my text and then I'm going to paste it here, right here. After pasting the text, I have to go to this side to make sure I give proper setting for the character. Here, this character matches with the voice, so I'm not going to change it. All right, so you can equally import your audio if you don't want to use text right here. So when that is done, the next thing you want to do is to scroll down to where you have audition. Yeah, in this audition, it's going to sound exactly what you're going to hear when you generate this video. So you click on audition and listen to it. So when that is done, you need to go up and then click on generate video. You're going to have this drop down. Then you click on start generating video. All right, you see the video generation has started. You can click on continue editing to go ahead and edit more clips. Then I'm going to create another video while the other one is being generated. So I'm going to choose a different character here. So the next thing I want to do is to add my text, right? Or upload my audio right here. So I want to add my text. I'm done with my text. I want to go ahead to change the voice. This is a female voice. So we're going to change it from female to male because we have a male character right here. So we're going to change that. So you click this little drop down icon here. When you click on that, you're going to see all the characters available. So I'm going to choose Brian. I love Brian. So Brian is here. I'm going to choose that. You can equally play it to hear what Brian sounds like. So the next thing we want to do is to go to audition and play this sound to hear what it sounds like, right? Here we have audition. So you're going to click on that for it to play. So when you're done playing, you want to go up again and click on generate video. And then you click on start generating. And that is it. Continue creating. So now we're done creating this video. The next thing we want to do is to go to our project and then start downloading all our videos. So we click on this little drop down icon here. So when you click on that, it's going to open up. Then you go to where you have project. This is where you want to go. So you click on project. When you click on projects, it's going to take you to all the videos we have been creating. So these are all the videos we've created from this platform so far. So what you want to do is to click on the one you want to download, right? You see the download icon, little light download icon there. You're going to download all of them, right? So when you're done downloading the videos you want, the next thing you want to do is to go to CapCut and then change the background and bring in any background of your choice. Add any animation you want to add and make your video stand out the way you want it to be. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified of my next videos. I'll see you in the next one.
Bye.